Hey, good morning, everybody. What is up? Morning, Blue. Morning, Dale. I think we should be up. Sorry for the late start this morning, guys. I uh, <laughs> very much overslept. Well, it's Sunday, so I don't know. Can you really oversleep on a Sunday? I slept longer than I thought I would. Let's put it that way. I, uh... <clears throat> Man, I think I slept for, like, a full ten hours last night. Which is crazy. You're making some lunch? I haven't even had breakfast yet. <laughs> but I'm not usually hungry right when I wake up, so... That's okay. Okay, so we're here in the middle of Portal Stories Mel, the unofficial Portal 3, guys. Holy shit! Okay. Starting off with a bang, it seems. Yeah, I didn't mean that we're exactly in the middle, okay? <laughs> it just meant we're not in the beginning and we're not at the end. Therefore, we're sort of in the middle. But with still very far to go, apparently. And, uh... Man, maybe it's not such a good idea to play this, like, first thing in the morning. <laughs> what the hell? Uh, it looks like maybe I could drop down there and then run across the pipes. Okay. An explosion blew the whole toxic goo pump station apart. It's letting flood wars up. We gotta get out of here. It's not safe. Get through the control centers. There's a transition seal leading up to where I am. Hurry before this whole place floods or comes down. Just trying to, <clears throat> I'm trying to install a real sense of urgency in me right now. Whoop. Okay. Oh well, look, that's convenient. But where does that go? Nowhere, it would appear. Let's take a look up here first. Unless this is just going to take me to the place where the elevator would take me anyway. Your life is at stake. <laughs> going to walk up the stairs with falling rocks everywhere. Yep. I get you're an Olympian track runner and all, but what's wrong with you? I'm crazy. I'm crazy, motherfucker. Don't test me. I do what I want. Hey, good morning, Z. Dale, I took the stairs before I even saw your message, buddy. <laughs> uh, huh. Ooh, fire. Got an autosave right there, which means checkpoints. Big fan of that. Oh wow, so much convenience happening right now. It's like my lucky day, guys. Remember, alert your supervisor. Yeah, we've read that sign a bunch of times. Okay. So the control room is right up there. Let's uh, take a look in here first. These computers look more modern than I would think if, if we were still in the 50s. I'm not sure. Were there really like personal desktop computers back in the 50s? Maybe if you were rich, like this company would have been. I'm honestly not sure. <clears throat> Do I have decent internet at the new place? Yeah, so I'm paying for the gig service from Comcast. And, uh... So it's not giving me a gig consistently. Uh-oh. Good. At least you 
won't suffocate in this room, but you still need to find a way to get to the transition seal. Is there anything you can use to put out the fire or something? Well, there is a big convenience switch right here. Um, when I, when I run a speed test, I'm not getting a gig consistently. I usually get anywhere from like 600 to 900 download, but, um, <clears throat> the service is supposed to be, uh, 35 upload and it's giving me 40 upload, which is good for streaming, so. Whoa, no, don't do that. You want to bring the place down in your head? Yeah, that'd be kind of cool. Bring the whole place down on me. Maybe I could set up a clever portal and just portal out at the last second, and then I'd be out of here. I don't know what that did for me realistically. The glass is broken, but I still can't shoot through it. Am I going to die from walking back this way? <coughs> Man. Sorry, I can't clear this frog in my throat. Where the fuck... Where do they want me to go? If a future you tries to warn you about this test, don't listen. <laughs> Could be a trap. Right, we're not in the 50s right now, but we. But when did this place go to hell, though? Because that would have been. You blew a water pipe. I got an idea. There's got to be water pouring out somewhere. Yeah, I noticed that over here. Oh, that's a portable spot right there. I see, I see. Uh, I can't believe that worked. Oh, oh, right, get going. Before something else happens. <coughs> Wow. Okay. If you'd been there a few seconds earlier, you'd have been incinerated. Thank the maker you were, though. <sighs> I need the muscle. Every now and then, he says things in, like, a really weird accent. Just, like, one or two words out of his whole sentence, he'll just be, like, incinerated. Uh... Guess I don't need to put that fire out, do I? Caution, this sign is radioactive. <laughs> I can't even tell how they mean that. Do they mean like this is the sign that means radioactive, or are they say this sign itself is radioactive? In this place, it could go either way. Experiment discontinued. Okay. Bad news! Uh, when the pump station blew, the floodgates opened up wide. Toxic goose rising fast, the sensors maxed out ages ago, warning lights woo, going crazy all around. This just got a lot more serious. Indeed. Keep out. No. But I want to be up there. So I can make a portal right here. Ugh. I can't reach that though. I don't remember the last time I passed a portable spot. There's gotta be another solution. <clears throat> Use a real world solution. Should I just uh, stack the crate so I can jump up? See, if Ferret was here, he would yell at me for forgetting I have portals. Just can't win, guys. Can't win. You got the isolation blues. Only a bit further and you'll be at the hatch up to me. Hurry. I'll try to slow the goo down a bit. Is that supposed to be like a reference to a movie or something? 
I'm not sure. It kind of reminds me of something, but I'm not sure what. Oh! Look at that! Just bring this along here. Great! Another blocked corridor! Okay. I can place a portal there, but I don't know why. Blue gel. The door won't open from this side. Maybe there's some other way around or something. Hmm. Maybe I could coat this in blue gel. Now it's going to bounce around like a crazy person. I'm not sure if that helps me at all. <laughs> Don't have your favorite snacks and you can't go out and get them. Yeah. I mean, you can go out shopping, man. Just wear a mask. Everybody's got to go out shopping at some point, you know? I actually just got a couple masks delivered to me that I bought off Amazon. I got a pack of three for, like, 15 bucks, I think. And they're nicely made, tailored masks. Um... Up until now, I've just been using, like, uh, homemade masks. I was using, like, microfiber cloths attached to my face with, like, a rubber band. <laughs> and it was very uncomfortable. It works, but it was not comfortable to wear. So I just spent the money on a couple actually nicely made tailored ones. And I actually got to make a target run later today, so... You probably have Coronas here forbidden to go outside. Yeah. That does make it hard. Uh, grocery delivery is an option. Right? I, I gotta assume you have that where you live. What the hell? Space! Hi! I love your username, Space. <laughs> That's awesome. And yeah, Blue, wasn't Game Night fun last night? I'm telling you, that's, I look forward to that every week. Game Night on Final Girl's channel is so much fun. I always have a blast. Dale, it's kind of too early for this shit. Can you, uh, can you give me a hint here? You can place a portal right there. You're right next to it? What? I know I have this blue gel here. I know I have the cube. I don't know how either of this helps me get through this door. What's your favorite thing about space? Space. I love talking about space. Please tell me. Your favorite thing is space. <laughs> gotcha. Well, I've got a balcony up there. Hey, Space, thanks for the follow. <laughs> Maybe he's in space, like, give me space, dude. <laughs> Maybe. I think my favorite thing about space is how almost every other galaxy we see is redshifted, which means that in a certain number of years, we won't be able to look out and see other galaxies. If there are future civilizations after humanity that do space exploration, they'll never know that other galaxies exist. 
which is like scientifically mind blowing and also really depressing and kind of like kind of somber in a way. What in the hell am I missing here? You sorted all your favorite snacks? Yay! It's awesome, man. Glad I could help with that suggestion. <laughs> this isn't even a puzzle. <laughs> I told you it's too early for this shit, Dale. I don't know what I'm doing. I just woke up. It's. Am I just trying to get onto this balcony right here? <laughs> Wait. Okay. Hold up. Hold up. Sorry, I haven't really been paying attention. I, so I can I can bring the blue gel out over here, and then that lets me jump. Okay. I mean that's that's a puzzle. It's just one I should have figured out five minutes ago. Come on. Hey, 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 hey. Get back here. Oh, the. Why'd I drop the block? Get up here. So, Mel, why don't you take your time? Look around here. I'll try to slow the rising goo down a little bit harder, I guess. Just. Don't take all day. <laughs> Great job, Mel. You're on the other side of that door now. Yes! Very good. Okay. So now I can... Yeah, I figured I would need a normal cube, so I gotta destroy this and get, get a new one. Another block? Or should I try right here? There we go. Come on, buddy. You're still coming with me. I might need you. If I can fit you through here. I'm not sure if this is allowed. Yes! Made it. And it looks like you're destined to die anyway. The doors are locked. Uh, back in the day, the wiring was a bit strange sometimes. Try turning some machinery on. See if that also unlocks the doors. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, stuff. Not readable stuff, sadly. Telling me I came all the way down here and there's nothing down here for me to interact with? Oh, happy to hear that, Z. Also, I apologize for my sailor's mouth. <laughs> Okay. The Know Your Series, Know Your Time Travel Paradoxes. Always avoid future self, your father, past self, and Hitler. That's the master list of people to avoid. You talk way worse around your kids. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> oh, how'd I miss this? That actually worked. I mean, great. Did it? I don't know yet. Let's go find out. Frame rate's a little janky on this today. 
Guess it's because they're ramping up the physics. Well, that's just great. Can't we get through a room once without stop blowing up or blocking our way? Ugh. Nope. Try to find some water again or something. <laughs> okay. At least this guy's helping me out with solutions. That's nice. That's where I came from. So we're trying to put out that fire up there, or maybe this fire down here. You got a... you got a plush companion cube? Oh, that sounds cool. Nothing going on down there. They made them a long time ago when Portal 2 was made. Gotcha. That make a pretty good pillow. I have no idea what to do in here. Looks like maybe there's some water spraying up that way? Or, no, that's just steam, I guess. No, never mind. They sold out in less than 24 hours? Damn. There's got to be a portable spot somewhere up higher. Oh wait, did I actually make one up there? I didn't even see that land, but that's kind of awesome. Okay. Oh, the gate's blocked anyway though. Well, what the hell? Oh, but there's water. Okay. So let's put orange right there. Dude, I would love a Ratchet and Clank plushie. <laughs> uh, let me use this to get over here. Maybe this will show me something else. Can I do it right there? Ah, oh, that does work. Look at that. Not really working to put it out though. How about that? Great. Yay! From there, there's just the walls. Don't get comfy though. I pulled the plug on some emergency runoff dams, but the goo is still rising. Okay. Rising goo is always a problem. Nineteen seventy nine. Wow. This place is massive. Whoever built this place must be a great architect. Up high at the back side of this room is a control panel. It controls the hatch. Try to get there. But I wanna hit this first. Yeah. Blue stuff is fun.
Oh. Oh, I see what we can do here. Just gonna get that a little lower. That a little higher. Okay. Let's try this out. Nice. I love the bouncing solutions, guys. They're so much fun. Okay. Now it seems that we need to get some right there in that spot. Chase Skywalker, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. I can talk, I promise. Can we, where can we get this stuff to spill out at? Chase is your friend. Well, welcome. Thanks for checking out my stream, guys. Just so everybody knows, I am playing this on advanced, so the solutions are quite difficult. <clears throat> Excuse me, the solutions are quite difficult. And it is taking me some time to figure some of these out. Yeah, this is an unofficial mod for Portal 2. Uh, I mean, it's not unofficial. It's, a, it's an official mod for Portal 2. Um, and some people consider it the unofficial Portal 3. I can't find any other portable spots in here. Oh, I can portal that spot up there. Does that let me get anywhere, I wonder? Okay. Half-Life gets a third game, but not Portal. I agree. Portal is the one that deserves an official third game. You're right about that. So this is going... I want this to go, like, straight up. set up that way, though. There's gotta be, like, a new spot that I can portal from here. A spot I couldn't see before, right? Wouldn't that make sense? right now. Why is there a portable spot right here, too? What's that used for? There's also one right here. Oh, maybe I can use that spot right there to... Spray blue goo onto the spot I was trying to hit earlier. Let's try that. That's good. 
I think I needed that. Okay. Nice. And now we've got the orange from somewhere. Hmm. Now, oh, now I can get orange gel set up right here. That'll let me run quickly into a portal right there. And maybe I can set this up so that I come out over there? Oh, 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 look at that shit. Uh, yeah, I think Ferris just been busy with stuff, but if you, uh, I believe if you click on the name that sent the message, you can then delete that message. My records show that at least two people were needed to activate the bolt hatch. You're one person. There's a bit of a problem there. I'm sure we can figure something out. Okay. Made a point to show me that right there. Won't let me throw this one. Hmm. So I'm supposed to hit both of these at the same time? Okay, there we go. Got it. Uh, don't worry about it, Dale. Whatever you're worrying about deleting, I didn't I didn't read it anyway. Alright, so that must be where I came from, right? What did I open with those switches? That didn't work. Oh my god. Okay, so do I need to run the whole way back up there? Is that it? 
Shouldn't have dropped down, I guess. Where did this thing actually open? Oh, all the way at top. Holy shit. Okay. How do we get up there? Uh, no, Z, I am not finished with Stardew. I just decided to not play it today, like this weekend, because I wanted to get started on this game. Uh, there's just, there's a lot of games in my backlog right now that I want to make progress on, and Stardew, you know, being a game that never really ends, I can kind of pick up and put down Stardew whenever. So I'll be back with it next weekend, but for today I just wanted to play this. How the hell am I supposed to get up there? I know, man. I love Stardew as well. <laughs> it is amazing. And I never even liked those kinds of games before I played it, but... Yeah. Yeah, this must be some really strong hinges, right? <laughs> For that thing not to break. Oh, there's a... There's a lift that'll take me up there, isn't there? I gotta get on that little platform down there. Okay, I guess I just go back down and jump back up. Then get on the lift. Boing. Really? Uh, let's jump across. Oh, come on, really? This is a puzzle in itself. How do we reach that right there? Hey, Joe, what's up? Good morning, man. Welcome to the stream. How you doing today? So I can give myself a running start, but I don't see any good spots where I can launch myself up onto that. Why is this a puzzle? I feel like I already beat this room. I just want to get on that damn platform. Also, I really hate how I can't jump over these railings. It really bothers me for some reason. That's not quite going to cut it. Watching on your 60 inch. Oh, that's awesome. I got to go buy a new TV. So when I moved, I just threw out my old TV. Because it's from like 2007. And it was... It was broken in a lot of fun ways, and I was like... It was also like an old LCD, so it was like really, really heavy, and I was like, I just don't feel like bringing this thing. 
I think I'm just I just trash it and I was like I'm just gonna go buy a new one <laughs> and now I've yet to do that because TVs are expensive but uh, I'm gonna do that soon Am I missing something here? I feel like this should not be as hard as I'm making it out to be right now. Oh, also, I got on top of the railing somehow. How'd I do that? Huh. Huh. Okay, was that the solution? I had to jump on the slanted railing just to get on top of it? That seems incorrect. <laughs> That's not the solution. <laughs> there was a walkable pipe. You know what? Fuck the real solution. I don't need it. Yeah, that is a plus. I like that. <laughs> Although, if I had to choose a way to die, drowning in goo, not the best, but not the worst either. Maybe they could study my body and learn some science from it, you know? That'd be worth it to me. Yeah, burn the solution's house down. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Ah, oh, great. You're here. Chapter 3. Finally get out of this technological nightmare. If you can get into the offices, I'm saved. You just might have to get around a few security defenses though, trying to keep the giant human eating rats out. Human re human eating rats. It's a thing I've not had to deal with in this franchise yet. But we'll get there. What's all that? Ah, that's creepy. It's like a whole bunch of cores staring at me. Ah, I don't like this place. Let me out of here. Space, thank you for the bits! Oh, I really appreciate that, man. Thank you very much. Hey, check this out. I have this set up. Whoops, I screwed that up. Yeah, bitty hype. <laughs> oh my god, more bits! Thank you, Space! That's so nice of you. Thank you, man. Who said you were done? <laughs> oh, dude, the frame rate's dying in here. Straight up dying. Does that give me a new... S no, that's not, that's not a new area. Uh, yeah, bits are basically Twitch's form of money. You can buy them and then you donate them to streamers that you like. And Twitch takes a cut, of course. But, you know. What are you gonna do about that? Hmm. Set up a portal there. Okay, so that's how I'll get out of here, I, I bet. But I gotta find the spot that I'm gonna take to get out of here. This one's hard to see. Uh, yes, if you give me bits, you give me money. That is correct. Oh, look, this is set up so I can climb out over here. 
Or maybe not. It's like an invisible wall pushing me back. Okay, never mind. That's not supposed to work. Oh, that is a new... I'm an idiot. I thought that was before the fence, but it's not. It's after the fence. Isn't it? Yeah. Sometimes I just go full idiot, guys. Especially in games like these. Got a spot right there. Looks like maybe I'm trying to get up there, which means... Hey, Z cheered one bit. Thanks, man. <laughs> you guys are being so nice to me today. You're gonna make me cry. So it probably has something to do with, um... <laughs> Thank you, Space. Just learned this magic thing. <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm still learning stuff about Twitch. I've been streaming on Twitch for, uh... Longer than I thought. It's already been like half a year. Which is crazy. There's still things that I... Don't know about Twitch. I just learned what a hype train was a couple weeks ago. Space, what the hell, man? You're being so nice. Thank you. So I've got to get momentum to jump up here, right? <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe you guys are still donating. Thank you, Z. Thank you, Space. Okay, so now I probably want to come... I probably want to go back out there, right? <laughs> Must give most bits. <laughs> yeah, I think if I... Man, this is a pain in the ass. But... I think what I'm meant to do here... ...is jump out of there and then re-portal it to be blue... ...as I fall? Oh god. Okay. This is actually even harder than it would be because... The frame rate's like just sucking balls right now. If you guys are thinking that's your stream, it's not your stream. Fuck. Push that back to right about there, maybe? There. Oh! Oh no! Ah, damn it. I almost had it. It's maybe one of those deals where I can just keep my momentum and then slightly adjust. Oh, that did it. I didn't even move, and somehow that worked out. I'm just glad it did. Hey, the floor's getting quite cold here. <laughs> the game took pity on me. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Hey, what's up, Indy? Hey, uh, over here. I'm right over here. 
Virgil. Mel, nice to finally see you. It's kind of dark here, though. You should turn the power on so we can get the lights working. There's some more offices on the other side of the double doors. Check there. Turn the power on first, then pick me up. What if I want to pick I know you up first? It's been a while since you had company, but uh, just leave me for two minutes. I promise, I, I won't go anywhere. Space, thank you for even more bits. Dude, I can't believe how generous you're being. Thank I you. I literally can't go anywhere. Please, just turn the power on. No, 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 please. Turn the power on first. You're not very good at listening, are you? <laughs> Come on, seriously? Are you scared of the light or something? <laughs> this stopped being funny five minutes ago. No, it didn't. You, you saw all those hard tests and you can't figure out how to turn a light on? <laughs> Take my bits. <laughs> I, I didn't know humans could break. Am I speaking in an accent that is beyond your range of hearing? I give up. Just leave me. You got an achievement beyond your range of hearing. <laughs> nice. Oh, I love those hidden achievement type things. That's funny. That seems to be the end of it, though. Alright. He wants us to find a light switch. That elevator's not working. Let's get over here. And see what we can find. That doesn't count. Is this water okay to walk in? Okay. Never really know with this game. Lights, check. Camera, check. Action, hopefully not. Detecting power surge at sub-basement station 26. Threat level, moderate. Activating security protocols. Now you can pick me up. Okay. That's okay, Space. You don't have to give me more bits. You've been extremely generous already. <laughs> okay, but now I'm going to die if I walk on that, so let's figure out another solution. Turn this back off. No. Overcomplicating? Is this just a matter of walking on top of these desks? God, I hate that I can't jump those. with the big bitties. Oh, man. Thank you, Z. Okay. Got it. Good. That floor was getting very cold. My motherboard was almost going critical. Alright. I know what you're thinking. Hey, Mr. Virgil Gorgai. How were you able to control everything and see everything in the old testing facility? Well, one simple answer. Wi-Fi. <laughs> I'm fully Wi-Fi capable. Anyway, take me over to the elevator control room. There's a management rail I can use to get back up to the enrichment center. Oh, and I um, can also get an elevator for you. Z and Space are in a, a bitty war for the badges. <laughs> Thank you, Z. Thank you so much for the donations, man. 
So, where's, where does this guy want to go? Does he want to go back to that room where I flipped the switch? Or somewhere else? Up here? Have I been up here yet? Ah, control room. This is the place. This is where he wants to be. Where does he want me to put him? I actually can't put him down right now, so I can't throw this switch. Ah, oh, there we go. Just be back on track again. Let me go back here and uh, get your elevator so we can get out of here. Yes. Okay. This should help. Th that wasn't me, I think. Detecting security override at sub basement 26. Generator override command initiated. Uh, override generator override command. Error. Error. Scanning for life forms. It's freaking bright. Unregistered life forms. Get you out of here now. We'll worry about that voice on the intercom later. I'll meet you upstairs. Toxic contaminant level from testing track. Legal whiskey rising. Time to contact with enrichment center to be determined. Flooding procedure commencing. We should probably leave before that happens, right? Hello again, Indy. You're having trouble getting Twitch to work? That is a good question. I didn't know that you could watch ads to get bits. I'll have to look into that myself, actually. The elevator, it wasn't going to my testing track, so I've rerouted the lift. Luckily for you, it's not too far away. These things can take forever sometimes. And there's no magazines to read. So annoying. Thank you, Space. Thank you for more bits. Welcome to my testing track. It's not the best looking thing in the world, but it'll do. Let's see if I can just get this door open and get us out of here. Oh boy. So. Okay, sorry, I can't help you with this testing track. All Aperture Science <laughs> AIs have been programmed to not help with solving the tests. I can, however, test to see if everything still works. It's. Been a while since I fell off that management rail and plummeted down into that pit, so maybe some stuff broke in my absence. Checking the funnel. Working. Fizzler. Moving over. And toxic goo drainage pipe. Eaten away by toxic gross and goo. Oh, lovely. Ah, uh, that's not important. You can do this test just fine. I, I hope. What? <laughs> He's talking shit on me behind my back. Um, I hope so. These are test chambers designed by Virgil. I hope these are better than the ones designed by Wheatley, because his kind of sucked. Yeah, I, I didn't know about that ad thing either, but that's actually really interesting. That's a good way to get bits without having to spend your own money. Interesting. Kills the portal when you do that. All right, so right off the bat, this is this is pretty hard. Let's try doing that there. It's not on it, is it? Right 
there. So the devs said it themselves, this is where the game gets harder. <laughs> gotcha. This is gonna be fun. That made a block drop. Okay. So I can bring it over with that. How am I going to get it through this? <laughs> I'll win this pits war. Got to be able to have the lift and this thing disabled at the same time. This gives me a portable spot in this room. But I can't reach it. That's the problem. You slept at the Denver airport like a hobo for three hours. I've been there. I've done that. <laughs> I have definitely done that. thing doesn't help me at all. What the fuck? Let's carry this over here. It's a whole other section to this puzzle. Oh my god. That locks me out of that. Ooh, reflector cube. Okay, okay. Uh huh. I hate these stupid fields, they're always preventing me from doing shit. Really annoying. That opens up that. What freaking use is that, though? As soon as I step on it, it kills the portal anyway. I could shoot out through here, though. Okay, alright. Gotcha, so now I can walk out here, bring this cube back. Swap these out. That allows me to bring the reflector cube. Let's see what happens. This one can pass through, but I assume I would die if I walked right into this, right? What is the reflector cube even used for? 
There's no lasers in here that I've seen. Other than this laser door. And also, this is gonna die if I try and bring it back through there, right? But I can take that cube back. Okay, so I've got both the cubes over here. Big question now is how I'm going to get one of them over to this side. Almost there, I'm just not seeing things. So what part am I missing, Dale? around the room and notice all portable spots. All of them. Okay. Not really noticing any that I hadn't noticed before. There's this here. Seems like a brain buster. Yeah, this whole game, I, I, I may have made a mistake choosing to play on advanced. <laughs> it's possible. I'm correct in thinking I can't carry these through this spot, right? That would kill both of these blocks. Yeah, they would die. Now, I know I could set up the lift... ...to kind of carry them over here, but I can't have the lift active, and I can't have this force field disabled at the same time. So, like, even if I set it up that way, they wouldn't make it over here in one piece. Yeah, I think Ferris has been busy with school stuff. He just, uh, he just moved back, apparently. 
So he's just he's just really busy right now. Man, this sucks. <laughs> as long as we have ferret in our heart, he is always here. That is correct. I got through that first part relatively quickly, but I'm like totally stumped about this. And the lift is like... It's, it's ascended a little bit, so I'd have to stack them and I can make the lift hit one of them. But I just don't see what good that would actually do me. They don't even reach that anyway. Oh, hold on. I have an idea. I have an idea. these like right here I think that'll work ha gotcha bitches Why did that make stairs come up? What the fuck? <laughs> um Okay. I'm not sure like how that triggered that reaction, but I I think I see the solution now at least. Hey, Z, thank you for the bits. I use my big brain, that's right. <laughs> great. Just great. It seems to tip off whatever that thing is to our presence. It has taken control of the testing track. Awesome. Hey, orange gel. Orange gel is awesome. Let's see, let's see. Let's get this nice and coated. Is that good enough? immediate threat. Is it like destroying the chambers right as I pass them? That's kind of a neat concept. This chamber was voted the hardest by the community. You know what? That's actually great. 
Let's get, <coughs> excuse me, uh, let's get the hardest one out of the way. And then hopefully it'll be easier from here on out. But you do think there are harder ones later? Alright, fair enough. But I will say right off the bat, this one seems hard because I don't even know where the hell I'm trying to get to. Like, where's the end game here? Up there? There's a catwalk up there. Hmm. That is a huge fan, but I don't know how much cold it's generating. It doesn't really seem to be windy in here, so, yeah. Um, so there's this, we gotta get the block to hit that switch up there, right? Question becomes, how do we make that happen? There we go. Okay. So I have to use the lift to get back over there, right? But at the same time, the block has to stay on the button. Because as soon as I undo that... What channel would I recommend you watching when I'm offline? Uh, my YouTube videos. <laughs> no. Um, I don't know, there's a... There's a fair amount of Twitch... There's a couple Twitch streamers I also like to watch. I, I watch Final Girl. Uh, I watch Miranda93. Um, those are the two big ones, really. Um, who else am I subscribed to? Uh, I like to watch Dan Riker and Mike Mahardy from Giant Bomb and GameSpot. Final Girl's good. Uh, she plays a lot of horror games. She plays Friday the 13th and Resident Evil Resistance. She doesn't play a lot of... Uh, She's not, like, a variety streamer like I am, so that's the only downside. I, I like I like people that play different stuff from time to time, but she's, she's a really good streamer. She's really nice, and her channel's fun. So, if, oh, if you like horror, you'll like Final Girl. Definitely check her out. Give her a follow. So, the second I do this... That's going to close. Let's see if I take myself up with it. Shot the wrong spot. Also, this is like killing the frame rate. There's another button on the wall right there. But I can't even make the portal go that way. How does she spell her name? Um, let me pull that up here. She does have kind of a weird spelling.
because she couldn't get the actual name she wanted. Where is her channel? There she is. Whoops. There you go. That's her right there. Yeah, Dale, you weren't kidding. This chamber is, uh... It's a little difficult. I don't think I can actually make that. No, you're not meant to just jump down from right there. Took you forever? You don't remember the solution? Okay. Yeah, this is gonna be tr this is gonna be really tricky. Well I know that um From here I could put a portal underneath the orange shell and give myself access to that room. Right? I'm probably going to want it right here. Not even sure about that, honestly. That lets me coat that. Oh, thanks, Z. I appreciate that, man. And I hope you uh, end up liking her content. I actually found her on YouTube way back in the day. And uh, she's actually, she's probably the reason that I started doing Twitch in the first place, honestly. Because I, I used to follow her on YouTube, and then she switched to Twitch, and I ended up watching her a little bit. And uh, I talked to her about it, and she said she was really happy making the, the transition to Twitch. It worked out a lot better for her. And I was like, maybe I should give that a shot, too. Did I figure it out already? I'm not even, I'm not sure that I did, Dale. <laughs> I know I have this stuff here. I still don't even know where the hell I'm trying to get to. Is the thing. Okay, this is the end right here. I've just got to make the portal. Uh, I've got to make it hit that. She, she's my grand streamer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I feel like I'm on I'm on the verge of figuring this out. I just gotta put the few final pieces in place. So this will let me run up. So let me run up and have momentum carry me somewhere. Is it even possible to hit this with the lift? It is. It would have to be right there. Okay. Okay. Sounds good, Chase. Enjoy your cereal. I feel like I need to get the rest of this coated as well. Let's put that there. Do that. Okay. 
Okay, that gives me the full run up. Now I can use this to... Use this to run up with the cube. Almost. <laughs> the portal spot doesn't even start till right there. Okay, well, let's put it over on this side then. Doesn't really help me that much. I'm trying to let that thing go right there. It's being a real knob about it, though. Just not sure how this orange gel helps me just yet. Thanks, man. I try to be cool. I do my best. It doesn't always work out. <laughs> but, you know. So, I need to... Dude, this, this chamber f is fucked, man. Hmm. If I could place... All right, so now that's going into the other room. If I could figure out a way to get up there without using a portal, that would bring me into the other room with access to the lift over there. That's what I need, right? That's the goal here, I think. Yeah, I'm on the right track. I need to leave that orange portal over there, don't I? So let's try... Okay. Let's put that on the ground. And then... Uh, I don't have this set up exactly right, I don't think. That's the solution, isn't it? I just gotta get more orange gel in front of the, the orange portal. I can just move this safely. Yeah, there we go. That's fine. Okay, now I'm up here. Now I make this blue. 
boom. And then... Then we go like that. Wait, wait. It's gotta be over here. Ta-da! I feel good about that one! That was pretty dope! That was a really hard chamber. I feel like I got through that, like, quicker than <laughs> my average would be for a chamber that hard. <laughs> Dale's so excited. <laughs> Look at him pop it off. Yes! 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 <laughs> Oh, that's awesome. Hardline bridge control center activated. Hardline bridge is coming online. Toxic contaminant level from testing track Lima Whiskey rising. Estimated time to contact with enrichment center. 25 minutes. I, I'm, I'm still working here. Seems like I've got to hack this thing. Come on, Wi-Fi. Don't fail me now. Jesus. I've got a good signal strength. They've... They keep referencing testing track Lima whiskey. I don't know what that is. I know that's just, uh, that's like military, um, what's it called? It's like the military phonetic alphabet, I guess you call it for just LW. What could LW be? All right, we got a block. We got access to orange gel. Can I walk under here? Hey, look at that. Can I steal a block from this? No. That's too bad. Ah! I deserve that. All right, well, we could maybe put some orange gel on the light slide. Does contain it rather well. It's hard to get it on that last spot there. There it is. So I can get a running start on that, or I could put this somewhere. No idea how that's going to help me yet. Looks like I'm trying to get up through there. What is this block for? It's not even tall enough to block any of these. I didn't realize I had access up here. Well, I don't. <laughs> what a bunch of dicks. Oh. I see. 
these things are powering these up here. Okay, alright, alright. I see the theory here. This is gonna be hard, though. Ah! Jesus. So I think we just gotta let this slide down here and then run through as it blocks these. Except it's not sliding, and now I'm stuck. I just trapped myself because it's not actually fucking moving on the slide. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Is that because I gotta put orange shell on it? <laughs> Suicide. Son of a bitch. Uh, hashtag die. I will say this, this game has very excellent checkpoints. Which I appreciate. <laughs> Commit Sudoku. <laughs> you, you know that's not the right term, right? I, just... We're, we all know that, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sudoku. That's funny. So I can only assume that that didn't work because... This thing needs to be coated in the orange shell? Oh, jeez. So that's the new... That's the new question. How do we... How do we force that? Oh, jeez. Day if I then redo it? No, this has to be set up first. How on earth am I going to get this set up first and then put orange shell on it? Craigie Crago, thanks for the follow. Much appreciated. Think outside the box. Okay. Oh. I'm not supposed to coat the slide, I'm supposed to coat the block. <laughs> Think of the outside of the box. <laughs> ah. Ah. God, ah, it's a pain in the ass. Okay. Run, 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 run. Yeah, I made it. Okay. Where did that block end up? gel now. Okay. Where is the exit? Oh, there it is. Okay. Well... I feel like that's not... quite enough. Maybe it is. No. That feels, that feels bad. Let's just jump in here? 
and do like a double jump? Can't do that. What if I just run and jump? Not quite enough, and now I'm down here. Where the fuck am I? Am I supposed to be here? <laughs> That's nice of them to give you a little, uh... A little catch right there. I do not think space has come back yet. If he has, he hasn't made himself known. Itchy nose. Oh, jeez. Alright, alright. Well, I would say we should set up a run and jump with the orange gel, but it's not gonna stick to the surface here. Not gonna stick to any of those surfaces down there either. And also, it appears I have to bring a block with me. So just getting there is not enough. Although. Hold up a sec. So I can bring this over here. Then I can maybe set this up so that... That falls through... Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Uh, that's fine, though. So I'm really afraid to lose this block, by the way. I guess I can always go get it again. So I was kind of hoping that dropping it through there would just make it bounce all the way over. Maybe if I get a running start from Orange Shell over there, I can run through. I bet you that's it. I probably wasn't supposed to bring the block over here. No, I have to. I need a block. That's right, I need a goddamn block. In fact, I may have screwed myself over by bringing this over here. It's okay, I can fix it. I can fix it. Okay, you stay there. Then we want, like, orange there, and... Is that gonna work? I'm not convinced this is gonna work the way I think I want it to, but... Let's just see what happens without the block. Yeah. That's what I thought. Oh. Oh, how about that? Overcomplication. Okay. Now I just need to get over here with the block in hand. I'll just make a new one. Oh, 
okay. Hey, where'd the block go? Oh, it's up there. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on! <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> I just can't quite pull the block through, otherwise this would have worked. Oh, that pisses me off. I almost had it. Wait, hold up. Let's just do that. C come on. <laughs> you little bitch. Damn it, where'd it go? Ugh. Yes. <laughs> Thanks for the bits, Z. <laughs> the salty bits. Yeah, I think I have a command set up for that, too. Salt. <laughs> Salt has been detected. Son of a bitch. Oh, so close. So close. The way this is set up, I can't even walk back through it either. So I can't tell if this is the right solution or not. If I could... Maybe I just need to figure out a, a spot where I can set up a running start here. One portal's in the correct place now. I just need to set it up straight, don't I? That was my issue. Now I can run right through there. And then that would go right there. Come out, get the block. I had the right idea at first, I think. I just tried to do it in an unorthodox way. There it is. I kind of sabotaged myself a little bit. Yes! I finally broke into that thing's server. I'll try and learn more about what's going on, but I'll keep you posted. It's really uh, unnerving that that other AI's voice. I don't like it. <laughs> right off the bat, Dale says, "Fuck this room." <laughs> that bodes well. That bodes super well. <laughs> Okay, I can has block. Ah, that opens up that up there. Okay. And I can portal that. Is that really not working? 
fine. Okay, we need a way to reverse the polarity of the field. Whoops. How the fuck am I gonna do that? Oh, look. We also have that up there. It's just, it's going the wrong way. I don't even know where I'm trying to take this stupid block this time. There's something up there. Okay. This could be helpful. Maybe. Wow, there's a lot going on in this chamber. Just a whole hell of a lot. Okay. Got up here with this. What does that do? You're about to write this room gives you PTSD, but then you thought of several more that do the same, but even worse. Oh, awesome. What did that do? That turn did that turn this into a portalable spot? It must have, because that's where I walked in originally, right? Well, I noticed that um No, I'm wrong about that. Okay. not changing anything that I notice. The fuck is that doing? Is it like a false trail? <laughs> I see it. It's changing the position of the force field. What a bastard of a room. Okay. I've got no earthly idea how that's going to help me. The only way that would really be useful is if I had another block up here. you think? Okay. 
Hold up. What good does that do? I don't see how this helps me yet. Am I correct in thinking that I need to bring a block up here for some reason? Ferret was here, he'd tell me something. Oh, look, there's another... Okay, so I'm trying to get the laser to here. Is that... That probably has something to do with it. <laughs> he told me I'm forgetting about portals. Is that what you're gonna say? <laughs> And then I tell him, shut up. I'm not forgetting about portals. I literally just don't understand the solution. There's a difference. So, okay. I, I think I do need to... There's a reason this spot here is portalable. I think I'm trying to cheat a little bit here. Nope. I'm sort of on the right track here, right? But missing some nuance to this. I take this? If I leave that in the middle... I 
There's no way I can hit this with a portal, is there? Yeah, PTSD from this room is just about exactly right, I would say. I don't know, man. I think I'm reaching that brain-busting part where, uh, my brain just sort of shuts down a little bit. Hold up, if I have it set up... If I have it set up... So that it's doing that. And then I kind of redo the block. Does that let me shoot through it real quickly? No. That'd be a little cheaty, I guess. Do it through the portal. I have to find the right spot where I can stand here and hit it through the portal. Actually, I think what I want to do... Yeah, I'm close. I'm, I'm really close. Ideally, what I'd actually want to do here is have it set up... ...so that I can make it happen by shooting a portal from here. That's what I have to do. I have to have it set up... Like this. Okay. Ow. Then I undo it. There. There. Holy shit. Okay, we're not we're not done yet though. Then Well, hold up. <laughs> so now I can walk side to side. I need to leave the orange portal up here, though. Just 
Still not sure how to get it over there. Still not quite putting this fully together. See that spot from down here? Oh, I can. I didn't think I'd be able to see that from down here. Okay. Oh, fuck. No way that still doesn't help. Shit. <laughs> ah. I have the block over here now, but I can't set up the portals. Son of a bitch. Well, the good news is... Now that I figured out this first part, it's really not an issue... ...to redo that progress. I just need to figure out... ...what to do from here. See, I can bring a portal over here now. The issue is I have to bring the block too. I'm definitely going to have PTSD from this room. There's no doubt about that. My issue right now is I, I can't get back up here if I drop down to get the block. How the hell do I bring the block over here? while still maintaining the orange portal up there. Do I need to drop down? Well, I could portal it to me from right there, but then I lose the blue portal over there. Okay, that brought it over to the blue side, right? And then I do the Okay. Okay. Motherfuck, that was hard. <laughs> Son of a bitch, man. Okay, what did that do? What did that do? Did that just kill this force field right here? Okay. Oh, that also opened up this. Interesting. So I don't need that anymore, right? I can bring this out here. Now I've got two blocks out here. No, 
not sure if I'm allowed to kill the portals yet. I'm always really worried about killing the portals I have set up, because I'm, I'm not good at thinking through the consequences of that, if that makes any sense. I can bring the laser over here. Does that disable anything over here? No, it doesn't. I guess the whole point is to get this over here, though, right? So I'm probably okay to do this now, I guess. That opens that. I still don't have a way to reverse the polarity of the lift. So it's really not all that helpful. Why is there one set up on that side, too? Yo, you want to draw some knowledge on me, man? I'm, I'm running into a brick wall here. Shoot through here. You're still thinking about it too? Okay, good. At least it's not just me. What good does shooting through here do? Because I can't access it from anywhere on this side, and it's going to go away as soon as I walk through here. How did I do this last time? Oh god. I'm not sure if I missed anything back on this side of the puzzle. That switch has been hit. That let me bring the block back over. Two blocks. I'm not sure how to use this lift to my advantage with the direction that it's going. I'm also not even sure, like... 
how anything helps me at all. Because I do not see any method... ...to get myself up there. We've got to get a block over here to disable that thing permanently, and then I guess I ride the lift over somehow, but it's going the wrong direction for that. Isn't it? And look, that thing's graded off, so I can't even use that to portal a block over here anyway. That wouldn't work. Oh, wait. How's that working? Oh, it changes depending on which side I put it on. Uh huh. Okay, so maybe. Maybe I put that right there. And then I come over here. Start by taking that up, or over, or whatever. Where'd it go? I think I have the right idea here. Execution is tricky. Orange there. Go up. And then right there. Fuck! Let's put that right there. It's pushed down. That's what's happening. How do I make it not get pushed down? Okay, I'm not even sure how the hell I did that, to be honest. But I did it. Somehow. Now I can keep that open permanently. Why did I need this other block? What's this for? Oh, that was just to kill that thing up there? What? Is that it? I think I need to bring it for the door? Yeah, maybe. It does have an arrow. Uh, okay. I guess I'll bring it with me and see what happens. So now... Okay, I guess I need to do this from over here. God, this is... This is crazy. Here we go. Oh! <sighs> Time to get us removed from the system. This game's ramping up, man. How am I still in the middle of chapter three out of five chapters? This game is freaking long as hell. 
and it's already so difficult. <laughs> it's just insane, man. I think we'll be in the clear for a little bit, but somehow I can't get access to the final target or even learn what it is. Whatever it is, it's enough to cause this thing to blow up toxic goo pump control down in the salt mines. Activate dangerous fireball. I just tripped an alarm in that thing's mainframe. <laughs> uh, it completely locked me out. Firewall, huh? Fire wall. That just gave me an idea. I I'm going to reroute some of the water to the AK servers. That should shut the firewall down. Target one organic. One mechanical reacquired for termination. Security measures at 75%. Alert status. Red. Toxins from testing track Lima Whiskey. Contact with Richmond Center, sub basement, level 10. Flooding procedures commencing. Shit's starting to get kind of real with H's here. Groobs, hey, what's up, man? Welcome to the stream, how you doing? Oh hi, <laughs> Groobs. This is a uh, this is one of the hardest games I have ever played. I would say we're like halfway through it, and it's already just ridiculously hard, like ridiculous. Like right off the bat here, what am I even doing here? What's my goal? There's a oh look at that. Uh, there's a. Uh, Spot up there, okay. Told me it was fair at difficulty. <laughs> that creates a bridge. Ooh. Well, that could be handy. That lets me stop in the middle right here. Oh shit, but then it throws me back out. Okay. But I can just walk through it. No biggie. No biggie. Now it seems like somehow I would want to use this bridge to catch this block. Doesn't exactly land normally, though. Shit. Yeah, I don't think it's quite close enough for me to catch it. And it goes in a weird way. Damn it. Ugh! Oh! There it is! That's... I, I, can't, I still can't reach it, though. <laughs> and I'll have to kill the bridge. I shouldn't have came to the center here. That was a mistake. That was a huge mistake. I was trying to be fancy about it, guys. There we go. Let's work smarter, not harder. How's that sound? Okay.
What? Your son just imitated the grunting noise. <laughs> That's hilarious. What's up, Groob's son? How you doing, buddy? Yeah, okay. The blue portal's getting caught up in it? <laughs> oh, I see what you're saying, because that's, that's the spot it lifts? It's not, though. It's the spot beneath it. Whatever. Sure about that, Dale? Cause I'm I'm kinda thinking not. It's killing the orange one. Okay, I guess that just means we gotta do this backwards. I'm not entirely sure how. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it was moving this thing in addition to these ones up here. It wasn't giving me all the information. Right, so now... That gives me a spot to launch from. There hasn't been quite as much launching in this game as I would have hoped for. I felt like you were doing that in Portal 2 all the time. In this one, they're like, man, forget that. So... The issue here is that I have to leave this set up to have those in position. As soon as I try and like bring the bridge over or something, it goes away. Now I can take the cube away? You just blew my freaking mind with that one there, Dale. <laughs> Holy shit. Dude, if you hadn't told me that, that probably would have taken me a million years to figure out. Wow. I'm still like flabbergasted from that. Okay. Now... I think I see what we have to do. I think I know the score here. So, I actually want... I want orange right there. I want blue right there. Nope, I screwed it up. I screwed it up. But you guys see what we're doing here. We want... That set up... I did this backwards the way I normally would have done it, but it's okay. There we go. But we're not done, it turns out. Okay.
We need a block on this switch. And on this switch. And we need the laser to be hitting the receptacle. This is a three card door. Wow, okay. So I gotta get... I gotta get at least one block up here, probably two. And I've gotta get the laser with the reflector cube up here. How the F am I gonna do that? I could put a portal up here, but it just dies as soon as I walk through. I've got to stand up here and get a block to propel itself up here while I'm keeping this turned off. That's the first start. That, like, that's the first part, right? And also, now that this red laser is engaged, I can't portal it anywhere else. I'd have to redirect it again with the block to make it go back to the original spot. Dude. I don't even know where to start with this. Okay, okay, okay. I can maybe set it up on the bridge so that it falls onto the ejector. Can I get out of the X room another way such that it leaves a portal? I don't think so, man. There's like no way that I can think of. Well, oh, wait. <laughs> You're right. Good call. Excellent call. Yes, I can do that. Now orange is still up there. Okay, that's a good start. Then I can bring this one in here. Okay. So now I don't have to leave the orange portal up here necessarily because this, this way is open. Although, I do, um... Hold up. I'm gonna need this for a second. I think I have to undo this. Then bring this back up. Pretty sure I had to do that. Now, 
getting that guy over. That's the next challenge. That actually might be really simple if I just do this. Why did I... Oh, this is the one that's that's creating the bridge. Oh, Billy. Oh, Billy. Is there... That's okay. I don't need the bridge, right? Just launch over with it. There's that. And then... Move this over here. Ha! <laughs> yeah. Trap panel? What? <laughs> I missed the trap. <laughs> Suck it, Aegis. Thought you were smart, but you're not. Except I still have to go down there because it's the only way forward. Okay. It's a little uncomfortable with Virgil's evil laughter there, but I guess it wasn't directed at me, so it's okay. That turns off the lift. Okay. All right, all right. What does this let me do? Huh? Oh, man. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to be able to do that or not. But I sure am going to die for trying it. Um... So I need to, I need to get up there. That'll give me a block, which I can use to turn this off. And then that'll let me launch over here. Didn't help me at all. <laughs> In fact, I think I just killed myself again. Yeah. Guys, imagine how long it must take to, like, actually design a puzzle like this. The amount of thought that must go into it. It's kind of insane. How am I going to use that lift to get up there? Can I portal a spot on there? No. I'm gonna try this one more time. Okay. I don't know how I screwed it up the first time. Uh, turn that off. 
Okay. Okay, okay. And then there's the people who teach other people to design puzzles. Like uh, the DigiPen Institute of Game Design. That'd be such a cool place to go to school. So wait, that's the exit up there. What's... So it's gonna be another block. So I need to... Take away the block. Bring it right through there. Oh, I didn't notice, that reverses the polarity as well. Interesting. I didn't notice because it was turned off, that's right. Probably gonna need this block, right? Maybe, let me bring it just in case. Video game high school. That's a good concept for an anime. That anime probably already exists, right? Okay, I didn't need this other one, but whatever. Now I can has two blocks. So that disables the thing and reverses the polarity. Now it's just a matter of riding this thing up there, or or I could just portal up there. Oh, I need to make it hit that spot right there. That's what opens the door. Okay. Just need to take away that block now. I gotta do it at the right time. Video Game High School is a Netflix series? Really? I've never heard of that. Hold on, I've almost figured this out. I can take away that block right there. The only issue is that that opens up the force field again. Hmm. Oh shit. Oh, I didn't mean for this. I didn't mean for this. Uh... <laughs> Whoops. Suicide. <laughs> oh, please have checkpointed me back where I was. Please, for the love of God. Thank you, thank you. This game's checkpoints are amazing, and I gotta tell you, that's... It gets very high marks for that. Very high marks. Just well done all around with the checkpoints. Okay, so how are we gonna do this? Let me figure out which spot is the right spot to make it hit the button. Is it right there? That looks right. That's the right spot. They've taken it off all the major streaming services? Oh, that's too bad. So if 
I put this in there now... Didn't quite work out. Is that an anime or like a live action series? I've never heard anything about it, so I don't know. Live action? Okay. Damn it. <coughs> this last part is really tricky. Trying to suss out the actual logic of it. Without killing myself in the process. Send that through. I think like right about then... ...is when I need to switch it out, I think. No! Man, what failed there? Which part of that failed? And also, will they just let me reset? If I just kill myself here, will I just go back to having my block back? Because that would honestly be preferable. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, generous checkpoints. So, if I do it now, it keeps the block over there. Portals aren't set up, and I can't re-portal it. Oh, for the love of God. We're reaching the end of my mental capacity here, guys. <laughs> I think once I figure out this puzzle, this is going to be a stream. 
Just this last little bit here. I wonder if my concept is flawed. I feel like I need to send it through and then manipulate it somehow so that it stays. One tiny thing that's not clicking. Okay, now it's stuck in there and it's going the right way. When I put the block back on... It's gonna be going the wrong way. If I put that there... No. Okay. Okay, now I needed to get caught the other way, so I need to... I think I need to take this off real quick and then, as fast as I can, portal there and there. No? <laughs> Not possible. I don't know, I got nothing else right now. I got no other ideas. Yeah, you're right, not possible. You are right. I think I have it in the right spot when it's all the way back against that one. I just can't figure out what to do from there. Why do I keep doing that to myself? Like, honest to God. We've definitely reached the limits of my mental fortitude for today. It seems that about three hours of this shit is about the max I can take. <laughs> yeah, give me a hint, please. Don't need two portals to take the block off the button. Oh, because I could use the lift itself to lift it up? <laughs> That's so clever. 
Wow. There's another lift transfer down below. Hold on. Activating the elevator. Now. Elevator car 77. Testing track direction compromised. Alert status 100%. Rerouting remaining servers to biological tracking. Target lost. Rerouting the elevator worked. That got its attention. Don't expect this to get any easier now. Keep going. There's an easy test track up ahead. Maybe you can gain some ground on it. Is it? Is it really though? Is it easy? I don't know if I trust them when they say that, but you know what? Either they're lying or they're not lying. If they're not lying, then that'll actually be a good place to pick up next time. If they are lying, well then, it is what it is, you know? So yeah, I guess we're like halfway through chapter three now, which I guess means we're about halfway through the game. How are we only halfway through this freaking game? Oh my God. This is going to be an ordeal, guys. This is going to be an ordeal. I'm almost chapter four. That's good. So I'm thinking um, I might take a break from this game tomorrow. I would really like to play The Last of Us on Grounded Difficulty soon. Which is also going to be infuriating from what I understand. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself all of a sudden, playing these really hard games. Um... Tomorrow we might actually check out Data Dream because I've been uh, I, I told the guy I would do that and I've I've had to put it off due to the move and everything. I think tomorrow night we'll check out Data Dream, and then maybe start The Last of Us on Tuesday, and then uh, maybe we'll come back to this on like Wednesday night or something. I'm thinking that might be the the schedule for the next couple days. You've never played or seen The Last of Us. Yeah, that does make you a heretic. <laughs> well, I don't know if you like uh, super depressing games that leave you feeling empty and horrible and miserable inside. But if you do, you're going to love The Last of Us. Um, <laughs> I do have a full Let's Play of it on YouTube already. But I'm going to play it again on Grounded Difficulty, which is the hardest difficulty. And apparently it's just ridiculously hard. But I I kind of, I want to give it a shot. I want to see how how quickly I can get through it because I, I do think I'm decent at that game. Now I haven't played it since my let's play, which wrapped up like three or four years ago. Uh, so I might be a little out of practice at first, but I, I am decent at that game and I want to see if I can get through grounded without, you know, sawing my own head off. So <laughs> we're, we're going to check that out soon, but yeah, let's say data dream tomorrow. We'll start the last of us on Tuesday. I'll play this again at some point during the week. Um, and yeah, it'll it'll be a good time. So uh, thanks very much for hanging out on stream, guys. Really appreciate it. Thank you, Dale. Thank you, Groobs. Thank you, uh, Joe. You enjoy your Sunday as well, my friends. Um, thanks for the bits, everybody who donated. Z and uh, Space, really appreciate you guys. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a have a good rest of your Sunday. Enjoy your weekends. Take care.